Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup episode number 8. So we ended up here and we could go down, I, I guess we can, there's no harm, is there harm? There might be harm, <laughs> there very well could be harm. An interdimensional caravan has stopped on this level and set up a bazaar. Hurry and find his entrance before they move on. Okay. Well, besides needing to take care of this guy, I think it is time that we try to um, start reading some scrolls of identify to identify scrolls. Well, hopefully one of these is magic mapping. Enchant weapon, okay. So, um, I am going to read these. Uh, ugh. Scroll of fear. Okay, that is useful. It's very useful to know that that's that one. We haven't found magic mapping yet, which means that it's teleport. I'm guessing that this four is magic mapping and this six is teleport. That's usually how it goes for me. I usually have less magic mappings than... So, um, if we end up teleporting on this level, it's not even the worst thing. <laughs> I just wish we could identify more scrolls first. Okay, I'm going to go on my hunch. My hunch is that this is teleport and this is magic mapping. It is a scroll of immolation. Well, I would have liked to have saved that one. And I'm also not fire, super fire resistant. I guess I'm using a thing of flame. So this is probably teleport. What else could be magic map? Okay, let's just read it. Yeah. Oh, God. We're just going to go somewhere. Hey, this is not bad. As long as these guys don't form big blobs. They don't for very long. Okay. What else could it be? We only have scrolls with two left, and I don't want to use those. Um, yeah, we're all the way on the other side of the map. Unfortunately, we also have no... Oh, I do not like Tengus. Okay, let's... Perfect. I could be using, by the way, uh, my magic shield a little bit more often. Never know where these interdimensional portals are going to be. Honestly, we would probably have to have known where it was in order to get there in time. Oh god, golden eye. Okay, didn't even uh, have time to look at that one. Unseen horror. Okay, here's an upstairs as an emergency backup. still have this guy. <laughs> They're coming. Did I get marked or something? Huh. Can't carry that. I forgot. That's right. Um... Man, we are getting a lot of stuff. I want to drop something. <laughs> Let's drop this hat for now. <laughs> these things. I want to be able to pick up these other stuff. But... Should be okay. Acid is not good. That's very not good. Uh, those scales are not going to be super good for us either. I know, I know. I'm looking for you. I guess we should be exploring these to see where it is. Okay, let's read another two scrolls of identify. Oh my gosh! We just haven't gotten any magic mapping scrolls. Even all just not good. Wanted to kill him as quickly as possible. Oh my gosh. We're crowded. That's not good. So actually divine shield to have a compensate for that. Oh yeah, we're not gonna be able to do this. 
Let's just look in. Uh, there's nothing we want here anyway. <laughs> Wait, is this a study the bell tolling nearby? Okay. Look, go away. I the stately bell was nearby. Could it have been like right next to us? Oh my gosh! <laughs> we made it! First of all, I'm gonna drop um, just a bunch of items here. Just because we want room for when we come back. We don't need all this stuff. Let's just drop all those. Um, let's drop this unidentified thing. Drop the other tomahawks. Okay, good. And let's go in. Hooray! Okay, so is there going to be anything, anything interesting here? Um, yes! Yes! Okay, so we want to buy both these scrolls, not only because, I mean, not just because <clears throat> we get them, and th that's great. I, in fact, I want these, desperately want them. Um, but on, on top of that, it's so funny that we were so close at the very start, and we teleported. <laughs> anyway, um, I want them because it will identify them for us. So we won't have to use scrolls of identify on them. And once all the scrolls and all the potions are identified, I, I feel pretty confident you have a, there's like a, it's a, you've reached a second, in my, this is just me, I get like a, a level of comfort. I actually may want to buy this scroll of enchant armor, I think it's really good. Um, 67 gold to get plus one on something you're going to be using. This is very silly, you're just buying armor class for 67. <laughs> and considering how much gold we have, which, how much gold do we have? 1412. Actually not too much, but I don't think we need any more, we'll buy all those other ones. Yes, we'll do it. For the next one, we have Potion of Agility. Um, is this a Demon Whip? A Transparent Whip, Long Plated Strip of Leather. It's not a Demon Whip. Normally Whips are not good, Demon Whips are good, but um, this is an artifact. It makes me really, really curious about it. There's no sense in putting something in here on our shopping list. Just doesn't make sense. We will not be able to come back. Yeah, we'll probably buy the... I mean, this is a good... Uh, the, the prices here are going to be very good. So we'll buy the Potion of Heal Wounds. So that's... That, to me, is worth it. I don't think anything else in here is... Well, obviously... <laughs> nothing in here but the Potion of Curing is even worthwhile. Even if it was free. So, the question then is, do we want to try our luck on this? We probably should buy the Scroll of Teleportation. How many do we have, though? We have a lot, right? But there's no... I mean, it's, they're good. It's good to have them. The more, the better. I usually do use my no the scrolls of noise, by the way, <laughs> just because the same way I like to be marked to figure out if I've... I usually use them on just like the next two levels to make sure that I've completely cleared out those levels. Oh, yeah, so the sound is a little bit loud, sorry. Um, so we have one, two, three scrolls, and what scrolls are we still missing? We're missing... We bought a scroll summoning now, right? Um, acquirement, of course. Brand weapon. I was thinking I want to carry the Morning Star. If you're wondering why I'm carrying a Morning Star around with this, it's because I, if I get a scroll of brand weapon, which might be one of the scrolls we have, um, I will definitely use that to brand a, mon a Morning Star, so I have a, a better weapon. The flails are. I mean, we're just. We should not be using the flails into, into like elf, <laughs> for example, or probably not even into snake pit. Um. Acquirement would be really good. Then I would just ask for a weapon. I mean, there's so everything is very weapon focused right now. So because this is just a, I don't know. I mean, what else are we gonna do with our money anyway? Agility unfortunately doesn't really help us too much. So we can examine agility. 
Dexterity and evasiveness is just, it's just, uh, it's a bit secondary. And usually I'm using most of my potion of agility early. Like in tough fights, I probably should just be doing divine shield and then a potion of agility on ones that I'm a little nervous about. Or a little bit more than a little nervous. Um, the reason for that is just, there's, I, I don't, um, yeah, I mean, there's a chance that this could be, what's it, snake bite? Which would be phenomenal. So let's just do it. Let's, let's buy it. And see what we got ourselves into. I will buy this scroll of teleportation as well, because it's nice and cheap. Alright, good luck to us. Okay, it's a plus four whip of Ithicule. So Venom and Resistance to Cold Plus. Well, it will help us if we go into like an ice thing. I don't think it's better, unfortunately. I mean, it's just, the Venom is nice. Hmm. Poisons the flesh of those it strikes, it protects you from cold. It still just doesn't do very much damage. Now, we have a whole lot of strength, so we can probably still hit things, and this thing will attack so quickly. We'll be doing two attacks per movement. Look, I don't regret buying it. I don't really regret buying it, because we have no weapon right now. <laughs> it's probably the best thing we have. I, I, I prefer flame over poison, in general. But having the resistance to cold built into this is... I don't know, it's, it's helpful. Yeah, we don't need any of those. Um, remove curse, that would be interesting only if... Um, we don't need this. Remove curse would be only be interesting if um, we were playing like Ash and Zari, that we would want to pick those up. And I, I just don't think we're going to need potions of curing. They don't do... They're, they're mostly helpful against poisoning stuff. So, I mean, I guess... Confusion? Clears the mind and cures poison and disease. Can also slightly repair rotting. Um, unfortunately, rotting is not going to be an issue for... I mean, it's not unfortunate. Unfortunate for potions of curing, we are immune to rotting. So I think we've done all we can do here. And there we go. So we'll pick up whatever items we can. G, H, I... I think we can get exactly these items. Okay, so let's continue clearing this floor, and then I will just put a pause in the video. Yeah, let's, let's see. Oh, yeah, we can. <laughs> let's drop one item so I can at least carry some food. <laughs> yeah, now we're engorged. Okay. So, we're expecting to find... Um, salamander. Dire Elephant. We're expecting to find the depths. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> the crypt? Depths? Uh, the uh, crypts somewhere. Have we encountered the crypts? They're in depths. Yeah, right. Oh, yeah, we're being attacked. Hello. He has a pull arm, and I wasn't paying attention. Uh, well, uh, joke's on him. He shuffled us in over water, but we're immune. And he can't trample me now because... We're flying over water. <laughs> oh my gosh, he can! <laughs> he doesn't care. That <laughs> was... I probably should... I mean, what, what was I doing? I should have Divine Shielded long ago. Uh, the poison's working out nicely, I guess. I You know, it's funny, because I talked about... Is this, is this deep water? That elephant did not care. What do you mean the undead are immune to poison? <laughs> Alright, let's go back in here. Grab this gold. We can probably explore. Uh, Auto-explore now. So I think that we've cleared out some of the, at least probably the most dangerous stuff. So that's one thing, that one reason why I don't like this. I mean, look at the room. The resistance to cold is nice. Let's see what this guy can do. Throw flame. So this is a fire fire focus. Okay. Cannot grab it. Um, what's this? 
Flail of Crushing. Yeah, this is... Well, we gotta pick up this stuff later anyway, so we can drop... Yeah, we have some other stuff here. I don't know. Scattershot and... Digging. These are two I won't be using. Probably not be using. Okay, done exploring. So we are done with dungeons. If I look for down, all I can do is go further into the depths. Um, certainly not something I want to do right now. Uh, so let's see, what, how, many, how long has this video been? 15 minutes. So I'll probably just pause real fast and do a quick item cleanup. First of all, I do want to grab these tomahawks back. But I, I, I want to grab everything back. <clears throat> I think I'll move everything to... <clears throat> let's see. I might actually just do this item cleanup later. Uh, at the end of the video. Um, no, because we might not have a chance at the end of the video. Yeah, now's the right time to do it, if ever. So I'll probably just grab all the items, and I, I guess I'll just keep them on vault, at the vault level. I mean, the uh, layer level. Dungeons 8, which is... <laughs> so, a little bit weird. Or, I don't know. Well, I'll figure it out. I'm going to start pulling all the items somewhere, though. Oh, before we do that, let's go grab this. And we can, no, sorry, read, scroll of noise, yes, loud playing noise, we can yell, and I guess there's really nobody else left on this level, we'll read the other scroll of noise just to be sure, hooray, <laughs> okay, so there's no, there's probably no way left in this level, um, Nice. Okay, so yeah, I'll just do my item cleanup. And where's the depths again? I'll move all this stuff here. I think I'll probably just move out everything out into this open area. Uh, yeah, and uh, even though it's not, it's a little bit, or I'll, I'd rather put it here or I'll put it next to the, the vaults. Okay, we're back. I did it. <laughs> I organized all the crap we have. Uh... I left some things behind, some things that we obviously don't need, like the plus one thing, uh, chain mail of fire resistance, we just obviously don't need that now. I didn't know which wands to take with me, so I guess we can decide this. We'll take polymorph, paralysis, ice blast flame, enslavement. Digging is nice to have in an emergency. I almost want to take all of them, but disintegration can be useful later. I, I kind of want to take the ones that aren't going to be useful later. The digging is just nice to have as an emergency. It's a defensive one, not offensive, so I'll take it. I left the, the enchant stuff behind. Left the potions we don't need behind. Um, these are all the re useful rings we have. We have extra fire, uh, cold resistance now. I think taking the fire protection is not bad, although we already have one. And probably taking the extra... You know what? Definitely taking the extra protection from magic would be good. And I guess we'll take the... Well, it's unlikely we're going to, let's see, orc, I don't know, I think we'll just take the protection from magic, we might even want to wear it, because our evasion, I mean, our um, armor class is pretty good, it's not terrible, um, yeah, I'll leave the, I'm still putting in the gourmand on, because I'm, I'm waiting for a better amulet, like, acrobat is better than gourmand for, <laughs> in a lot of ways, right, it still gives you some evasion, evasion is just not going to be our strong suit, so... Gourmand, in my opinion, is, is not worth replacing with with that. Um, okay, so we'll be trying to use Tomahawks. I, I'm going to hopefully do a better job. I'm looking at all this stuff. It's always a reminder to me. Uh, Tortuga, you need to use your stuff. You, you don't... There's no bonus for ending the game with more items. So please, please, please use it. Anyway, let's go to um, Orc Zero. And now we have some space in our inventory, too, which is always nice. Well, eight spots. I guess that's not that much. By the way, what's what's at this store? Yeah, we were. <laughs> we can take these off of our list now, since we really don't need them. Um, I think in every way that these are outclassed by the current stuff we have. Yeah. Yeah, pretty sure. Uh, depends on if... I mean, if we can't handle... If we prefer... Uh, is there anything better here? Still no. Yeah, blinking at will is awesome. Turning invis at, at at will is awesome. Um, the noise, not a. I don't 
I think that's a huge problem. The problem is mostly that it's just a battle axe. So battle axes are great. Um, but I don't think it's worth it. This is, it's not like it's replacing a really good shield or something, but here we go. Okay, yeah, so this will be interesting. Um, we'll definitely take some people up. <laughs> so it's going to be easy going in the beginning. Uh, just killing, bringing up, bringing back down. That's what we're going to be doing. Probably, I, you know what, I am going to wear my... Put on my ring of magic protection. Just give us this extra... Let's replace the... <laughs> Plus sing, six ring of protection. A little bit funny that it asks me. <laughs> Why would I want to replace a ring of protection with a ring of protection for magic? <laughs> it's the same thing. And we go, and hey, what do you know? You fly downwards. Um, uh, enters a dispersal trap. Okay, it entered a dispersal trap. So now we actually have to fight. This might be a good time to use some of our special stuff. It's not going to be used anyway. Like, what if we just use the box of beasts? What did it give us? It gave us a juvenile batsing beast. It, 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 those aren't usually going to be that great anyway. Yeah, let's just get them out of our inventory, right? We'll use this. This will actually... Um, what do we want to hit? I think I just want to hit the... Well, I can get a good line of things if I do this. Okay, I killed an orc. It didn't go where I wanted it to. How's our health? Are we still being attacked by that? So what am I getting killed by? It's got to be this orc priest. Okay, let's go ahead and... It's actually out of line of sight now. They can cast through people. We cannot hit them through people. Um, despite the fact that I have one pip of our... <laughs> I don't think I'll be using Immolation. Could use a Scroll of Fear. That... Um, those are a little bit less useful later in the game, too. So, let's use a, a Potion of Agility. Because, why not? And we're spending all this time just using potions and stuff. We might as well... Oh! La, you, you wonderful little creature! This guy has just done it for us. A bizarre creature twisted and warped by overexposure to magical radiation, a juvenile bat, bat, sting, bat, sing, bat sting beast. Each has a different set of traits. Yeah, that's right. Uh, these box of creatures, creatures, they are like a combination of two different things. So this guy is apparently a poison creature, flies swiftly and unpredictably, and sports a set of venomous tails. It is juvenile, no longer larval, but it below its mature strength. That's just evocation skill. Um, anyways, it can hit, and it stung, and it killed what is one of the most dangerous things here. Um, this guy's a little bit scary. Let's see what else we have in our inventory. I mean, we're... Whoa, whoa. We're doing a good job of clearing things out with our inventory items. <laughs> Why stop now? I bet that might all... That might be everything we can... Yeah, this is inert. The Lamp of Fire, it... A lot of the items you can get, miscellaneous items, they take a little while to recharge. You just need to kill things to build that back up. Still felt like this was probably an appropriate place. I think that I want my Ring of Protection on again. Okay, now let's go over here, kill this guy. What is hitting us? Lots of pole arms. And another priest. <clears> hmm... <throat> This, I think it is an okay time to use a scroll of fear. Okay, so you can see the exclamation mark in the top right indicates that they are all fleeing. Um, where's my downstairs, or upstairs? Wait. I'm not sitting on top of it. Do I not know where it is? Go to orc one. I don't, <laughs> that's a little confusing to me. I, this is the stairs, right? 
I can't really see. Ah, uh, staircase back to the dungeon. That is it. Okay, so you can barely see it, but it's behind that guy. So I, if I want, I can just kind of charge straight towards this. The fear is working, and I'll step into the flame. Oh, God. Teleported me again. Stop! <laughs> okay, we... <laughs> Let's take a moment to collect ourselves. <laughs> We can eat some corpses as well. What do we have here? Hand axe of chopping, not a big deal. That's just a typical thing. Engorged, fantastic. Okay, so we can go back down. Now what's our game plan next? Maybe to use some of our, our wands. Um, not too bad. I think we can just kill this guy directly. Just wanna make sure we are wearing our Protection and magic. Okay, good. So that guy is now the vampire guy is doing that thing. Oh gosh, it's getting bad. You feel stupid. Oh god. Who? Oh no. Oh no. The Neko Jack gestures at you, and we feel stupid. You have a small pair of antenna on your head. Well, we got some mutations. Malmutate has, has done its thing. Now, this thing cannot follow us up, so we will go up the staircase. And we'll kill everything here. Unfortunately, that stupidity thing is... Gonna make it so that we can't wear helmets. Wait, you feel stupid. No, that must have been the stupidify. He his thing antenna is just basically giving us a penalty where we cannot wear helmets. Now, honestly, I've always wondered how gargoyles can wear helmets anyways. I thought that they had like I don't know, maybe I've seen pictures of gargoyles that are not um exactly correct. Let's go down, pull these guys back up, kill them again. Plus two leather armor, not gonna be super interesting. Okay, wait. And plus one mace of venom. I mean, <laughs> it might be. <laughs> I'd rather use the flails, but okay, what do we have left down here? Pretty much nothing. So that antenna is really annoying. Anyway, I guess it's time for us to, to finish this video. Super annoying. Um, don't know how we could have handled that so much better, though. It felt about right to me. We had both resistance to magics on? No, we had one plus six ring of protection, so we were probably an easy target. Well, um, I'll have to think about... I guess we can kill this guy first. Oh, God. It's these, conj it's these guys who are just ruining it for me. Plus two chainmail fire resistance. Yeah, I don't think we need that. But there we go. Finally cleared to Samaria. We'll continue in orc in the next video. So thanks for watching, and until the next one, take care.